so good afternoon all of you so today we will start the chapter number 3 okay already we have studied uh, two chapters now the basic three chapters are divided for the managerial functions okay basically there are five managerial functions first is planning organizing staffing leading and controlling so third chapter is a leading and controlling so whatever the basic information what overall information of the uh, managerial functions last two managerial functions is it right so already we have discussed about planning organizing and staffing in the staffing selection process hr re recruitment process okay performance appraisal training and development so all the pa part already we have discussed uh, now after selecting leading is very important okay what is the leading what is the controlling now after that uh, pa uh, five manager functions will over and last chapter of this section is a uh, different departments so uh, let's start the chapter number 3 Now unit number three is a uh, leading and controlling. Okay, basically the leading and controlling is a manager functions. So what is the syllabus for uh, this chapter? Now if you consider the leading, okay, in leading, person managing, in leading, human factors in managing, which factors are very important for the leading? Is it right? Uh, next is a motivation. Now, leading as concern motivation is uh, what is the motivation different types of motivation what are the process of motivation different theories okay in that theories uh, we will see short different theories but for our syllabus two theories are said okay carrot and stick and the Maslow's theory so we will discuss uh, there are uh, eight to ten theories okay so we will discuss in short but uh, this characteristic and Maslow theory is important for the, as point of view uh, examination of university examination. Okay, but if you uh, required very get rate study, okay, uh, uh, some management study is required. Okay, so then you can study all the materials. Okay, so I will provide notes also. Now leadership, uh, what is leading leadership? A concept, styles of communication process. Okay, which style we have to follow doing in uh, working in industry. Okay, so that will also we will see concept, style, process. What is the communication process? Now, already we have discussed about the hierarchy of the organization. Okay, uh, in first level, first level or top level management. Okay, middle level management, supervisor level, and last is a. Uh, with the workers so what will be the communication process okay so in detail we will study in this chapter okay types of uh, communication oral communication maybe here written communication non-verbal communication okay, so in detail we will study the last part is the controlling process of controlling and different control techniques we will discuss okay so let's start with leading okay Now what is the leading? The leading is a process of influencing people so that they will contribute to organization and group goals. Very simple definition. Leading is nothing but the, the process of influencing people. So we have to motivate the people. When we will say that, uh, we will uh, say that uh, this person is very leading. Okay, our leader, as per your behavior, as per your working time and stability, okay, or initiative, so that all the factors are you can say that the leading okay basically what are the synonyms of leading so we will see here in last line we have discussed uh, written here or here uh, synonyms of the leading so we what is actually leading so we can say that the main person okay if you consider uh, in an in industry number of people are there number of workers are there so who is a leader okay according to his qualification according to his degree so we can say that the leadership okay our main chief okay chief or major prime hmm, most so these are the synonyms of the leading okay we can say that the main manager 
chief di- executive director ceo okay whatever the major prime uh, like prime minister okay so most important so for uh, these are the synonyms for the leading okay so basically leading is nothing but the process is it right leading is a process of influencing people influencing is nothing but that that people will will start to work initially or immediately okay effectively we can say that huh? so influencing people is nothing but motivating that people so that they will contribute the organizational goal and whatever the group goal okay so this is a important factor or definition of the leading is it right so uh, different types of leading we will discuss but uh, this is the definition now leading is related to the manager okay as we are studying this subject as a point of manager okay as a point of view of manager is it right so manager must be able to make employees want to participate in achieving an organizational goal so every manager's duty is that which duty it managers must be able to make employees participate in achieving the organizational goal so whatever the work contribution of work you have to contribute work the uh, distribution of that work and after that collecting whatever the data so entire goal of that industry will or that organization will fulfill this is a quality of leader who is a leader as uh, our point manager is a leader okay, so each and every manager will do work with the help of different worker or whatever the available manpower inside that organization is it right so this is a basic definition of the leading huh? now after leading who is a we, we will see that okay so what is a boss and what is a leader okay, already we we know what is a uh, leading what is the quality of leader okay so that will also we will discuss but before start the leading or whatever the study so we will compare first of all what is a boss and what is a leader is it right so behavior of particular uh, employee or particular managers or our behavior in future so we will increase our positive behavior okay so we will compare what is a boss and what is a leader difference between boss and leader Okay, so this is, this will not ask for the examination, but if you will uh, got an idea, okay, what is actually leader? So definitely our behavior will change, okay, as compared to boss. So what is a boss? Drives employees, okay. What is a uh, boss duty? We always say that, okay, uh, leader is good or boss is good. Always leader will be appreciated by the society. Why? Because whatever the behavior of that leader is better as compared to the boss okay so boss will uh, drive with the employee the boss kai karnar ha je kai kaam sangitle te karun ghyaycho tumhi pan leader kai mannar hai ha chala apan kaam milun ko okay this is a leadership quality boss kai mannar hai kaam tu karun ghe and that is nothing but the difference between drives the employee okay they will drive the employee but leader coaches them okay driving and coaching is very different ha huh? driving is nothing but Directly action they will give, directly signal, okay, or directly uh, order they will give. Okay, but leader, if you consider a leader, will coach you. Okay, so okay. So leader will we can consider the coaches them. Okay, okay. So leader we can consider the coaches them. Now next difference is uh, depends on authority. Okay, and on goodwill. So we can uh, who is the boss? No, as per the authority we can. Select the boss. For example, in any manager in that industry. Okay, so we can say that the boss. Why? Because this is the education of that particular manager, the experience of that manager. Now depend on authority. So what authority they are having? What power they are having? So according to that, um, whatever they are having. Okay, who, who is boss? Okay, so we can say that the this is a depend on authority. Boss, we can say that depend on authority but leader on goodwill okay what is a uh, leadership quality or what, uh, what is a uh, work of leader definitely according to uh, whatever the how one meter okay so what are the depends on authority boss we can say that on on goodwill 
okay what is good will is nothing but uh, they will work uh, very properly for we can say that the uh, whatever the work completion quality of that we bol na said this okay they will give direction to you ab kiwa apan tala ka mhanto sadichcha mhanto good will is nothing but sadichcha okay so leader will take good will on this leader will decide on good will and boss will depend on authority okay so this is the difference between boss and leader now inspires fear okay what is a boss will inspires fear and leader will generates enthusiasm okay me boss kay karnar bhi te karnar ya e kaam karun tak nahi tar mag tula terminate karel ki salary cut karel memo kadel okay this is the quality of boss okay but inspires fear bhi te karnar baknar hai boss okay but leader will generate enthusiasm okay what is enthusiasm leader will give uh, try to create enthusiasm ओके म्हणजे हा हे काम कर तुला ह्याचा हे फायदा होईल मोटिवेट करेल तुम्हाला तो ओके सो दिस इज द क्वालिटी ऑफ लिडर ओके ना बॉस इज ऑलवेज सेज आय अँड लिडर इज ऑलवेज सेज आय वी ओके बॉस बॉस काय म्हणणार आहे मी केलं मी केलं ओके इज इट राईट सो लिडर काय हा आपण केलं आपण करूया ओके सो दिस इज अ व्हेरी स्मॉल डिफरंट बट व्हेरी इफेक्टिव्ह डिफरन्स इन इंडस्ट्री ओके सो कीप इन माइंड वेन एव्हर यू विल बी इन इंडस्ट्री सो ट्राय टू work with the help of leadership qualities okay don't will uh, don't follow the boss rules okay because boss is different and leader is different is it right but uh, as per work authority okay as per work we we will convert leader to boss also boss to leader also okay so that there is motivation there is we will discuss in next uh, ppt okay or next slide okay so both qualities are very important so boss is always says i and whatever leader is always says i we is it right now next boss places blame for the breakdown okay and whatever leader fixes the breakdown okay now places blame for the boss kay man raha jalo tumcha mo jalo tar leader kay manare ha fixes the breakdown with the help of overall team हे बॉस काय म्हणणार आहे हा हे आपल्या काय एकावरती कोणावरती ब्लेम न करता ओके सो दे विल कॉन्ट्रीब्युट सक्सेस ऑल्सो इन फेल्युअर ऑल्सो ओके आर डिस्ट्रीब्युट ऑल दी व्हॉट एव्हर द सक्सेस वे हॅव व्हॉट एव्हर व्हॉट एव्हर फेल्युअर वे हॅव सो वी दे लिडर विल डिस्ट्रीब्युट ऑर टेक द व्हॉट एव्हर दी काय म्हणतो आपण त्याला रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी ओके सो लिडर विल टेक रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी ऑफ all the success as well as failure know how it is done develop people now boss is always will ask you okay so why you this work we have not made but leader will say that now nah, this is a procedure of work they will give now this is nothing but the development of people okay bro leader will try to development of people boss is always want to only the related to the work only okay know how it is done ye kaam kase gelo tu sang evad mana rahe boss ओके बट लिडर काय करणार आहे डेव्हलप पीपल विथ द हेल्प ऑफ एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑर गिव्हिंग द व्हॉट एव्हर द इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट दी पर्टिक्युलर वर्क ओके सो दिस इज ऑल्सो डिफरन्स बिटवीन बॉस अँड लिडर इज इट राईट हा नाव नेक्स्ट इज अ हा बॉस इज युजेज know how it is done and shows how it is done okay ha ya ta he ulta zalo baka now boss kay manar hai boss is always knows how how it is done mhanje te kaam kase gelo tumhi okay sanga but leader will show how it is done okay this is a different between now next is uses people and whatever the leader develop people ki uses is nahi but boss asel to kaam ata vapar karun yanar fakt okay so there is nothing yes okay so they will try to only make work fulfill okay but leader will develop people okay always leader will say that whatever the development of people uh, employee inside our industry or organization uh, this is the aim of that leader but but boss is only uses the people okay so this is only dealing with work completion is it right so this is the difference between boss and leader now boss is always take credit and leader is always gives credit definitely boss kay manar hai kaam mi kele mi kele okay at the end of work completion but leader will he kaam mi kele as like i and we okay boss is always says that i and 
leader is always say that we is it right so commands boss will give different commands and leader will ask boss ka kana hai ye kaam karunga leader ka mara hai kaam apan karuya ka okay so this is a difference between or communication uh, difference between the boss and leader okay if any doubt is there you can ask ha so next is a uh, leader will give commands and leader will sorry boss will give commands and leader will give or they will ask whatever the work okay a boss will says go a leader will say let's go is it right so this is a very simple difference so try to make always leader huh? don't make boss okay but if any emergency work is there if any employee will take a, a whatever the kaam to apan jala gair payda ओके तुमच्या स्वभावाचा जर गैरफायदा जर घेत असेल एखादा माणूस लिडरशिप क्वालिटी मध्ये तर यू शुड बी ऍक्ट ऍज बॉस ऑल्सो ओके सो दीज आर द मॅनेजरियल क्वालिटी ऑर फंक्शन इज इट राईट सो बॉस विल ऑलवेज सेज गो अँड लिडर विल ऑलवेज सेज लेट्स गो म्हणजे जो काय म्हणणार आहे काम करायला चल करा जावा हे काय म्हणून चला आपण काम करूया दिस इज अ डिफरन्स ओके सो एव्हरी इंजिनियर ऑर एव्हरी एम्प्लॉय शुड नो वॉट आर द क्वालिटीज ऑफ लिडरशिप okay what we can compare with boss with leader okay so this is a different that will be helpful for our changing behavior okay so keep in mind all of you if you will be in industry or any organization try to work with the help of leadership qualities okay then and only your growth and satisfaction of work will be there okay so this is a difference between boss and leader okay now some human factors in managing okay if you consider the human factors in manager which factors is very important for the management okay now human factor approaches focus on how to make the best use of the capabilities okay which factors okay approaches focuses on how to make the best uses of these capabilities so whatever present inside that industry or whatever the factors required for the completion or organizational goal okay so some factors are required okay so we will discuss that factors also now that factors are depending on designing jobs and equipment which are fit for people okay which as per the knowledge as per the experience as per whatever the um, behavior of any employee so they have to contribute or they have to distribute workload also okay by designing jobs and equipment which are fit for people je kaam je amar sar vyavasthit asel that work will we have to give to them is it right ha huh? so the human factors are projects focuses on how to make the best uses of these capabilities by designing job and equipment which are fit for the people uh, this is a not only improves their health and safety but often ensure a better managed a more effective organization so what are the duty of manager okay are if you, uh, you you can say that what is the duty of management okay so whatever the safety and health care of that particular employee is also duty of that manager or management or organization okay neither ha sakai 8 la ye kaam alan de ki sandhya kai 12 ek asta da रोज हे चाल सो दॅट विल बी डिस्टर्ब द हेल्थ ऑफ दॅट डिफरंट एम्प्लॉय ओके सो दिस इज ऑल्सो इथिक्स ऑलरेडी वी हॅव डिस्कस इथिक्स इन मॅनेजमेंट ओके सोशल रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी ऑफ द मॅनेजर ओके सो दॅट फॅक्टर्स वी हॅव टू कन्सिडर इन लिडिंग ऑल्सो ओके सो वॉट वेन द लिडरशिप क्वालिटी विल ग्रो सो वॉट एव्हर द फॅक्टर्स वी विल डिस्कस वी विल कन्सिडर ऑफ इच अँड एव्हरी एम्प्लॉय ओके सो दिस इज ऑल्सो मेन ड्युटी ऑफ द manager every manager should uh, discuss or consider the health and safety of each and every employee okay then and only that leadership quality or whatever the organizational goal we complete satisfactory or the as per expectation okay suppose if your your employee is very nervous why because you are not paying okay you are doing uh, maxim, uh, maximum work okay as compared to others okay so that will be very critical for that employee or that employee will also not satisfy okay they will nervous so as per the norms okay so leadership quality or whatever the this is the duty of a leader okay no multiplicity of roles no average these are the factors huh? 
मल्टीप्लिसिटी ऑफ रोल्स नो एवरेज पर्सन द इम्पॉर्टन्स ऑफ पर्सनल डिग डिग्निटी ओके एंड कंसिडरेशन ऑफ द होल पर्सन ओके सो वॉट इज अ फर्स्ट मैनेजर फैक्टर इज अ मल्टीप्लिसिटी मल्टीप्लिसिटी ऑफ रोल हाँ दैट फैक्टर्स ऑल्सो दे सो वी विल डिस्कस फैक्टर्स फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल हाँ ह्यूमन फैक्टर्स आर देयर ओके सो विच फैक्टर्स आर देयर सो दिस इज सिटिंग ओके लॉट ऑफ फैक्टर्स आर देयर वी विल डिस्कस इम्पॉर्टेंट फैक्टर्स ओनली ओके सो फर्स्ट ह्यूमन फैक्टर इज अ मैनेजिंग ह्यूमैंस मैनेजिंग ह्यूमैन फेल्यूअर यर और वायोलेशन सो वॉट आर द इम्पॉर्टेंट फैक्टर्स इन मैनेजमेंट ह्यूमैन फैक्टर्स इन मैनेजमेंट ना फर्स्ट फैक्टर इज अ Managing human failures. Suppose now these are the quality of leader, ah, huh? leadership. So we can discuss that as per uh, heading is a leader, leader, leadership. Okay. So every manager or every leader inside that organization will think on that managing human failures. Suppose if any failure will happen with the help of different employees, so what we action will be there? Okay. We have to. Uh, Investigates, okay. Investigate that things also, okay. अतः T V रास्ते पर बगासर के बाद में अतः आज का ये बगासर T V रात तीस साल उजास्ते बगा पुना से का ये जाले पुना से का ये जाले मंत्र जे जाले जे जाले ओके लगे इस का ये investigation करा सो कुछ लावा so what is the output okay so as per manager or behavior or leadership quality whatever the failure or whatever the uh, Output of that work. Okay, every leader should consider their factors. Okay, whatever the errors or violations. So, what action will you take on that errors? Okay, so what is the solution to over overcome that errors? Okay, so this is also leadership quality. ये कहता है तो चुकलास काम करता है ना नवीन आसिल तो वर्कर. So leader का ये करें तो लगे तो हाँ ये काम कैसे हम चुकले यहाँ जाने. Okay, so they will also try to repair that errors. Okay, or repair that. failures so this is a very important factor of human factors in managing okay as leadership quality okay next is a procedure every leader or uh, whatever the manager which is having leadership quality okay so they will give detailed procedure to the each and every employee is it right so whatever the procedure or okay so uh, procedure or methodology whatever that manager will also do that or they will also think on that okay this is also important factor of human factors in managing training and competence okay so every leader will give whatever the training what is the procedure of training already we have discussed the training and development point in last lecture okay so training and competence so all the factors uh, related to the training competence so leader each and every leader will uh, think on that okay training and competence whatever the uh, ability of that particular employee so leader will also give training and they will find out the whatever the uh, competence or desert or whatever the eligibility of that uh, particular employee okay or as per the qualification of that employee so that factor is also very important as if you consider the uh, third factor of management or human factors of management okay stopping we already uh, studied that what is the process of stopping 
ओके रिक्रूटमेंट व्हाट एवर द ट्रेनिंग एंड डेवलपमेंट परफॉर्मेंस अप्राइजल ओके एच आर रिसोर्स रिसोर्स मैनेजमेंट ओके ह्यूमन रिसोर्स मैनेजमेंट नाउ नेक्स्ट इज ऑर्गनाइजेशनल चेंज ओके सो इफ यू कंसिडर लीडर ओके सो लीडर विल ऑलवेज थिंक ऑन हाउ आवर इंडस्ट्री और ऑर्गनाइजेशन विल बी बेटर एज कंपेयर टू अदर्स ओके वट वेदर द एनी इनोवेशन इज रिक्वायर्ड सो लीडर विल ऑलवेज थिंक ऑन दैट फैक्टर्स हाँ सो दे विल ऑल्सो इन्फ्रास्ट्रक्चर ऑफ ऑर्गनाइजेशन ओके वॉट एवर द इनक्रीमेंट ऑफ दैट ऑर्गनाइजेशन ओके और वॉट एवर द दे विल ट्राई ऑलवेज आवर इंडस्ट्री विल बी एट द टॉप लेवल सो लीडर विल ऑलवेज थिंक ऑन दैट ऑर्गनाइजेशनल चेंज ऑल्सो ओके वॉट एवर द चेंज इज रिक्वायर्ड एज एज पर द सोसायटी इज चेंजिंग ओके Now safety critical communication. Okay, so this is also human factor. Safety critical communication. They will also uh, follow the communication guidelines. Okay, leader also so malo ke aare tu re karad bas naan na industry mein. Okay, kya hai kadal ta akun bol na wagere. So safety critical communication. Okay, so whatever the health and your safety, they will also consider. So this is also human factor as leadership. ओके ह्यूमन फैक्टर्स इन डिजाइन ओके सो दे विल ऑल्सो ट्राई टू मेक अ डिजाइन एज पर डिजाइन और एनालिसिस ऑफ ईच एंड एवरी एम्प्लॉय वॉट एवर द वर्क सो दे विल ट्राई टू इनक्रीज द डिजाइन क्वालिटी ऑफ दैट ऑर्गनाइजेशन ओके फटिक्स एंड दी शिफ्ट वर्क दे विल ऑल्सो टेक दैट हाँ फटिक एंड वॉट इज अ फटिक फटिक्स इज नथिंग बट वॉट एवर द कैपेसिटी ऑफ दैट वर्क ओके नहीं तो वर्कला सका आठ वजता बोलवा संध्या बारह वजता घरी जा मना ओके का जाए का व्यवस्थित चल तो जाए का ओके सो दैट वील ऑल्सो वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर दी वर्क इज यू ट्राइट सो ऑर्गना फटी गाय सो थकवा मुझे अपन जाना ओके मैं तेजा कैपैसिटी ऑफ वर्क ऑल्सो दे वील डिस्कस इज यू ट्राइट सो हाँ फटीक है शिफ्ट वर्क ना शिफ्ट वर्क इफ यू कंसिडर देर आर बेसिकली इन एम एन सी कंपनीज ओके यू माइट बी नोइंग देर आर शिफ्ट वर्क ओके वॉट इज अ शिफ्ट वर्क सो दलवेज इंडस्ट्री इज ऑलवेज इन वर्किंग ओके सो दे विल गिव वर्क फॉर दी एम्प्लॉय ना इट इज इम्पॉसिबल टू कंटिन्यू वर्क विथ ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स ओके सो फॉर दैट पर्पज इंडस्ट्री और ऑर्गनाइजेशन हैज डिवाइडेड वन डे इन टू थ्री शिफ्ट ओके सो फॉर फॉर एग्जाम्पल Eight, eight hours, eight hours, eight hours. Okay, eight into three, eight, twenty, twenty-four. Okay, so that is a shift work. Now, what is a shift work? So that manager also change the shift. Okay, for example, I can do this, do this such a shift asset. Sir, next thing, what I am going to do, work distribution should be there. So manager or leader will also think on fatigue of each and every employee and whatever the shift timing of the that particular employee. Okay, now organizational culture. So leader will also think on the organizational culture. Definitely, leader will think on the organizational culture. They will uh, always try to maintain the culture of that organization. Okay, for example, uh, if you consider whatever the um, different, if you consider as a Indian culture, okay, there are different events. Okay, अपन काम तो चला बोलो. रिजन रिलीजन एज पर रिलीजन एज पर दिफरंट इवेंट्स ओके दैट मैनेजर और दैट लीडर विल गिव द वेरी डिस्ट्रीब्यूट ओके अपन जरा फॉर एग्जाम्पल Now they will think of each and every religion. Okay, मुझे अपन जरा काम तो सर्व दरों में संभव आते हैं कि वह प्रत्येक लोकल जा प्रत्येक समाज जा इवेंट आते हैं, सन सनावड़ आते हैं. Okay, so they will also think that they will maintain culture of that uh, entire organization. Okay, so definitely these are the human factors for the leadership quality. Okay, now maintenance, inspection, and testing. So they will always try to maintain. 
ओके व्हाट एवर द मेंटेनेंस ऑफ एंटायर इंडस्ट्री ओके इंस्पेक्शन और मेजरमेंट वी कैन से देयर क्वालिटी चेकिंग टेस्टिंग ओके सो लीडरशिप व्हाट एवर द फैक्टर्स दीस फैक्टर्स आर आल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर द लीडरशिप क्वालिटीज ओके सो दीस आर द ह्यूमन फैक्टर्स ओके सो बेसिक थ्री फोर ह्यूमन फैक्टर्स वी कैन राइट ओके सो नंबर ऑफ फैक्टर्स बट इन फॉर आवर सिलेबस फोर फैक्टर्स आर देयर मल्टीप्लिसिटी ऑफ रोल Okay, so leader is having multiplicity of role. So leader is not having only single role. Okay, so they will also act as manager. They will also act as worker. Okay, they will uh, always act as market manager. Okay, so overall work, whatever the entire work is, depend on that, whatever that particular manager. Okay, so he, no one is in industry having single load. Okay, or single lo role. Okay, so multiplicity of role will also handle the whatever the leader. Okay, now this this is also called it of leadership. Is it right? Ha. A paste your roll numbers. Huh? Ha. 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 चार पाच जागेत सहा सात आठ नऊ आहे त्या जागे सगळे ठीक आहे ओके आय विल टेक अटेंडन्स ऑल्सो हा डोंट मिस द लेक्चर सा so so multiplicity of role okay so each and every uh, manager or whatever the leader inside that industry or organization is having always multiplicity of roles okay now this is also factor human factor no average person okay so what what is no average person they nothing but they is having number of qualities okay तो म्हणजे काय सर्वसाधारण माणूस नसणार आहे तो इंडस्ट्रीमध्ये लिडर म्हणजे आपण कोणाला पण लिडर म्हणणार नाही ओके सो दे शुड हॅव द डिफरंट फॅक्टर्स ओके दे शुड हॅव डिफरंट रोल्स देन एज ओनली वी कॅन से दॅट दिस इज अ नो ॲव्हरेज पर्सन ओके सो दिस इज ऑल्सो फॅक्टर द इम्पॉर्टन्स ऑफ पर्सनल डिग्निटी ओके व्हॉट एव्हर द पर्सनल डिग्निटी दे विल ऑल्सो थिंक ऑन ईच अँड एव्हरी एम्प्लॉईज हेल्थ इज इट राईट सो दिस इज ऑल्सो ह्युमॅन फॅक्टर नेक्स्ट इज द इम्पॉर्टन्स ऑफ पर्सनल डिग्निटी ओके सो दे विल ऑल्सो विल कॉन्ग्रेच्युलेट यू दे विल ऑल्सो मोटिवेट यू ओके डिफरंट कॉन्सिक्वेन्सनेस सो दीज फॅक्टर्स आर ऑल्सो इम्पॉर्टंट फॉर दी वॉट एव्हर दी इफ यू कन्सिडर द ह्युमॅन फॅक्टर्स ओके अँड लास्ट फॅक्टर इज द कन्सिडरेशन ऑफ दी होल पर्सन इज इट राईट सो कन्सिडरेशन ऑफ होल पर्सन दो वॉट एव्हर द लिडर विल नॉट से ओनली फेल्युअर वॉट एव्हर द करेक्टनेस दे विल ऑल्सो विच इज अ लॅगिंग पार्ट ओके सो ऑलवेज लिडर विल ऑलवेज टेक दॅट पॉईंट ऑल्सो सपोज इंडस्ट्रीमध्ये एखादा वर्कर असेल त्याचं एखादं काम टेक्निकली दिस इज व्हेरी ही इज व्हेरी स्ट्रॉंग ओके बट इफ यू कन्सिडर द कम्युनिकेशन ऑफ दॅट पर्टिक्युलर पर्सन इज लॅक ओके सो दे विल ऑल्सो कन्सिडर दॅट फॅक्टर दे विल ट्राय टू गिव्ह ट्रेनिंग ओके सो द दिस इज ऑल्सो best or important human factor of the management is it right so that all these factors we have to consider in the management level okay so these are the human factors ha huh. our next point is a motivation huh? so we will give you very small uh, information about motivation huh? now motivation now what is a motivation uh, as leadership we are studying so motivation is a very important factor for the leadership okay, so they will always give motivation okay leader will always give motivation to the next level of manager or next level of worker 
Okay, so motivation is very important. With the help of motivation, we can do any work in industry. Okay, with very effective. So they will also take the benefit of same. Is it right? So motivation is a general term applying to the entire class of drives, desires, needs, wishes, and similar forces. Okay, so whatever uh, qualities is having leadership. Okay, our leader is having different qualities. So they will try to generate okay different class of drives, desires, needs, wishes and similar forces. Okay. They will try to motivate each and every um, each and every employee of that organization. Okay. Our managers motivate their subordinates. Okay. Subordinate is nothing but who is working in next level. Okay. Managers motivate their subordinates is to say that they do not think which they hope will satisfy. Okay, these drives and desires. Whatever the desires, drives, needs, wishes, okay, and similar forces which is having, uh, which will be helpful for the motivation. Okay, so manager will motivate to their subordinates is to say that they do not think which they hope satisfy these drives. Okay, and they will induce the subordinate to act in a desired manner. Okay, so what is the motivation? Okay, we can see that a need is. Okay, as need will generate in interpretation of goals, okay, in incentive according to one's perception. Okay, goal directly behavior, accomplish of the goal. Now, this is a way of motivation. Okay, when we will give the motivation, suppose if any uh, need is happen, okay, if any need is generated, so fulfill that need now. Motivation is very important. Suppose we want to uh, finish one work in that in industry or organization within one day. So what will the procedure of to completing that work? Okay, so we have to give motivation to the employee. Okay, so then, then and then only that employee will get motivated and they will start work and they will start uh, complete the whatever the work within given time. Okay, so that factor or this is also depend on the motivation. Okay, so leadership is always having motivation qualities okay so if in need is generated interpretation of goals or incentive according to the one's preparation perception okay so goals directed behaviors according to the behavior you can direct the goal okay whatever the achievement whatever the goal we have to reach up to that goal so this is also depending on the behavior of that employee and motivation is that to change the behavior of that employee okay they will think on that, uh, this is my industry, okay, this is our industry, okay. So they will always think on whatever the behaviors of that each and every employee. Okay, so motivation is having that. Accomplishment of goals and need reduction. Okay, so at, uh, basic requirement of that motion, motivation is nothing but that to accomplish the goal. Okay, they, his uh, final target is to accomplish the goal and need reduction. Okay, need reduction is nothing but the need reduction with the guy some funda guy now. Okay, they will fulfill that needs. Okay, as we have started from needs, okay, whatever the need is generated at the end of motivation, whatever the that need will be reduced. Need is reduced is nothing but the we have fulfilled that need. Okay, need are half, Duma, Gunnu, Gunnu, Mas, like that. This is a not way. Okay, but we have to give satisfaction to that person. Okay, so this is a important factor for the motivation. Okay, so different motivation theories are there. Okay, so we will discuss that motivation theory in the next lecture. Okay, so this is also very important uh, or interesting part. Okay, so we will discuss this part in tomorrow's lecture. Is it right? So what we have discussed today? Okay, we have started the leading. Okay, now whatever the human factors in managing and motivation we have started. Okay, so what are the factors, human factors? Definition, what is the difference between boss and leader? We already discussed. Okay, human human factors in managing. Okay, human factors in managing. Which factors are important for the management? Okay, managing human failures, procedures, training and competence, stopping, organizational change, safety, critical communication. Okay, human factors in design, particular and shift work, organizational culture, maintenance and inspection, testing. 
so that factors are also considered in the human factors in managing okay and after that we have started the human motivation the definition of motivation way of motivation need that satisfaction of need is nothing but the for that purpose motivation is required okay so at the end our goal should be accomplished okay all our goal will be accomplished and we will reach to the expected solution or expected result okay so this is nothing but the leadership quality required for each and every of you is it right so hope you all have understood hmm? if any doubt is there you can ask me so for this chapter uh, maybe five lectures will be sufficient okay five lecture 2021 20 2021 lecture mode section section will be first will be finish okay and next 20 lectures will be required for 20 or 25 lectures will be required for the second section okay so try to make revision okay so ha uh, as per the study material okay so i think study material is not with you hai na so i will try to send study material okay all the study material is ready but due to some changes or updation we are not sending that okay so as possible as we will send the share material say study material okay so if any doubt is there okay you can ask me ha huh. so i will stop the recording first of all okay so thank you for attending this lecture so i will take attendance don't left